and welcome to Ayo and Ebo Entertainment welcome guys and if you're just joining us for the very first time we say a big welcome to you thank you for stopping by and checking out this video guys please subscribe to our channel hit the notification bell okay guys so on today's edition we will be showing you Somali wedding versus Nigerian weddings as you know weddings are a big deal like wedding ceremonies are such a huge celebration because it showcases you know how much you love your spouse and you're willing to go all the way so today we're going to be showing how Somali does it and how Nigeria does it let's see who goes bigger all the way <laughs> stay tuned guys let's dive in yeah. So this is one thing like both cultures definitely have in common makeup like no makeup no wedding period <laughs> So this is the bride's entrance with the entourage, you know, to be honest, I feel like this is the most simple entrance dance I've ever seen. Look at the bridesmaids. They are so, so calm. Unlike Nigerians, which I'm going to show you like in a bit. But enjoy this while we get to the crazier side of weddings, Nigerian weddings. <laughs> Hey family, I present to you Nigerian weddings. You see these guys dancing? This is not the bride and groom. This is just bridesmaid and groom's man. Like, why such this way? Is it your wedding? Is it your wedding? Trust me, they're so extra. And these guys are usually like a minimum of 10. 10 bridesmaids and groom. And they all make like such an entrance. But I won't be showing you all 10. What's a party without food? Man, look at this meals. Like, I've never ever tried a Somali dish before. I am so looking forward to it. What's the name of this one? Mmm, yummy meat. Okay, so I like Odias. Guys, leave in the comment section below the names of this, this meals. 
and like the best dishes that are served in Somali weddings. So in Nigerian weddings, there's usually a lot of meat, patty jollof, plantain, lots and lots of fish, the furry roll, too many food, too much food, too much food. So now, yeah, we're getting into the entertainment proper. So this is a Somali wedding, right? And But I'm guessing that this is not part of the Somali culture. Guys, let us know in the comment section below if this dance is actually a Somali dance or just a group of dancers from another culture, you know, performing. So I feel like apart from you know those very energetic aunties that were dancing like in the middle of the aisle while people were gathered around him. I feel like Somal is a very calm. Look at how the bride is just dancing with her friends. Oh look at the little boy. He, he's not interested in dancing. Okay. Okay little boy. You see, they're so calm, gentle, just grooving, having fun. Well, <laughs> again, you should see how Nigerians do this. Like Somalis, are you this calm or it's just for the cameras? Like so calm. <laughs> So this is what I was trying to explain to you guys. You see how really, really extra the brides can be? This is a typical Nigerian bride. They really, really, really go all the way dancing like they're on steroids. And there's something about Nigerian weddings as well. There is always this thing like they're always spraying money. The groom is spraying money, his friends are spraying money, the guests are spraying money. Like, apart from the rug on the dance floor, the other thing people will be stepping on is money, money, money. Like, I don't know if this is in all the cultures, but this is very, very common in Nigerian weddings. People love to showcase how much wealth they have. <laughs> One thing I definitely picked up from this video that I've watched is some dance, some Somali dance steps. Well, I noticed that the weddings, like Somali weddings, are usually all about like the women. Like when I was watching this video, it was like a three hours video that I was watching this particular one, and it was 
I didn't see guys. I almost thought it was an all-woman thing and maybe the groom would just come in at some point. But then into the video, I saw that, oh, their men were actually present, but they were just not so there. I don't know why. Guys, why is this like this? Look at the guys. They're so calm and this was the only place I saw them coming out to dance. Unlike Nigerian weddings where from the very start, the bride and the groom and his friends and everybody are just all over the place. Interesting. <laughs> Guys, so this is it on Somali weddings versus Nigerian weddings. Let us know in the comment section below what you have learned. You know, you must have learned one or two things like the differences or the similarities between both cultures and the way, you know, they celebrate weddings. Like, honestly, I cannot wait to, you know, we can't wait here at Iron Ever Entertainment to receive our first invite to a Somali wedding i feel like that will be like a dream come true as much as it'll be a dream come true for the person actually getting married being invited will be a dream come true somali weddings guys hurry up get married and send us that invite guys another thing we'd like to know guys you know leave in the comment section below what happens at, during the preparation and during the wedding itself guys thank you so much for joining us you know like this video share this video and we love you so much peace out guys